Hello and welcome to Richland Spotlight, an ongoing interview program where we talk with city staff and shine a light on programs, projects and events happening here in our city. Today we're happy to bring on to our program the City of Richland Redevelopment Project Manager, Miles Thomas. Thanks for coming on to the program, Miles. Glad to have you here. Thanks for having me back. Well, the reason we brought you on is to basically talk about a new monthly out-of-office program that uh, the Business and Economic Development uh, Office is doing called Ask Richland Business. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Sure. So Ask Richland Business is an opportunity for the city to um, make our business development function more accessible to current and future business owners. You could think coffee with a cop as the point of this exercise, um, but with a clientele that often has more irregular hours. We want to take appointment scheduling out of the equation and provide regular hours that you can just drop in for a specific business purpose or to ask us a question. So what kind of services or information would a business owner or a potential business owner find at this event? Sure. Uh, so we can provide in-house information on city grant programs, contact info, and uh, the opportunity to figure out how to navigate through permitting, um, building services, energy services, um, and contact, getting you in contact with those other departments. We also have a host of external partners that we can connect people with. Those services might include business counseling, financing, gap funding, or um, services to find available property for their business to locate. So what is one of the main advantages for a business owner to take advantage of this, this mobile office? So we feel that while people are starting a business, they generally know the steps that they have to take to, to get started. Um, but pinpointing how and when to access each of those services is a little bit more difficult. So rather than waiting for entrepreneurs to approach us, we wanted to set up shop and make ourselves available outside of regular business hours to entrepreneurs that um, may have more pressing questions. So now you're going, this is the monthly thing, so you're going to vary it throughout throughout the city in various mm -hmm. geographic lo locations. Is there uh, like a set time and, or date during the month? And let's just say a business wants to host this. How do they, how do they do, go about that? So um, any business um, that would like to host um, me or another member of staff uh, for business hours can um, either call our office, 509-942-7583, or email us at info at richlandbusiness.com. As far as visiting um, at the Ask Richland Business Hours, we will post well ahead of the event on city website, social media, information about the date, place, and time. Okay, so it'll, it'll vary, but we'll make sure and get plenty of information yes. out there for when people are going to do it. Absolutely. So if uh, somebody's interested in this but just can't make it out to the, uh, the event, where can they get additional information? So if a business just can't make it out, if a business or an entrepreneur can't make it out to Ask Richland Business Hours, then they can call our office and set a regular appointment. Um, again, that's 509-942-7583 or they can email us at info at richlandbusiness.com to set an appointment. And of course they can also go online to the, the city's website yes. at uh, forward slash ask Richland Business for more information about that as well. Yes. Well, very good. A good yeah. place to, to go ahead and stop this. So again, if you'd like more information on this program or any other thing happening here in the city of Richland, just the best place to go is check out the Richland webpage. That's the link at the bottom of your screen. And if you're not following us on any of our social media sites, including Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram, I strongly encourage you to log on and give us a like. I'm Michael Charbonneau, and thanks for joining me on this edition of Richland Spotlight.